Is this episode five? Yes, I believe it is. <laughs> All right, check it out, man. We just went over to, um, where are we? An N city. Yeah, that's right. We're at an N city. Um, this is where our coordinates are. So I'm gonna have that. Um, let me grab some of these in case I fall off the face of the earth here. Let's grab some of those. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They are actually useful, believe it or not. They are good to have. In fact. Might want them in my hot bar. Um, I was curious, hopeful in fact, that we might be able to see a boat from our spawn here in the end city. Wishful thinking, I know, but it's possible. It's definitely happened a couple times for me. I know it's happened many times in the history of end cities, which are fairly new, by the way. If you are returning to Minecraft or new to Minecraft, you might be like, where is he? And what are those purple weird things? As you may have noticed, I haven't really taken the opportunity in this channel to explain Minecraft to you, because um, I am under the impression that everybody plays Minecraft because it's the greatest game ever. Hello. <laughs> but, um, yeah, if you don't know where I am, like, look it up. I don't know. There's plenty of, like, cool tutorial Let's Plays out there. There's plenty of um, information on the Minecraft wiki, etc. Um, so I'm not necessarily into explaining everything out, and sometimes I probably do explain things that I don't even need explaining. But, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm really just hoping to find a boat for my elytra. I can't see one right now, so instead of boring y'all with um, more chatter as I search, I'm just going to go find one, and I'll cut back in when I do, just like this. Well, that took all of five seconds. Uh, if I had turned my render distance up, I bet we could have seen it. I would literally spawn like right over there. I threw one ender pearl to this platform thing, I pull it over real quick, and boom, we have a boat. We have a boat. So um, I'm going to record all of this. Uh, you know, I, I've been trying to like make short, sweet little clips like I said in the last episode and, and short, sweet vid videos all together um, rather than like my hour long nonsenses. I realize that's just too cumbersome to watch. I don't even watch videos that long unless it's like a podcast or something. Um, but anyways, yeah, so we have an end city. I'm going to explore. I'm going to try to glean as many shulker shells as I can. In fact, yeah, that's probably wise. Um, but yeah, we got a boat, which means we have an elytra. And I have like two and a half stacks of firework rockets on me. See, because I'm a planner. I love it when I can either bring some phantom membranes or like an unbreaking three book. That's obviously ideal um, with your elytra. That way you don't just use them up right away. But um, I did not have access to that, and I didn't want to wait around just because I didn't have access to that. So, um, no one breaking free, but hopefully our elytra can, can last us. And to, here's my theory, right? If you, if you're, let me, let me speak. <laughs> if, if your elytra can last you long enough to find another pair of elytra, then you're good, right? You don't really need unbreaking. You don't need to repair them. Um, that's the theory. Maybe it's a hopeful one, but if you can do that enough times and get your hands on, like, I don't know, maybe, like, three, four, five elytra, like, you're solid. That's all you probably will ever need unless you're total dope and die often and in horrible ways that make you lose all your stuff. Yeah, that's not cool, right? Um, oof. Oh, my God, I had to shield up in time. In fact, that's going to change, right? There's, like, this weird, like cooldown thing or warm-up thing whatever you want to call it when you throw your shield up it doesn't actually protect you right away and i think that might change with the new combat update that's probably gonna come out right um yeah so so there's that oh, i'm gonna fall um i just gotta watch my health a little bit because i don't have the best armor but i'm gonna try to kill as many of these fools as i can get their little shulker shells like that Oh, I hate floating away. It is obnoxious. Especially when you're trying to film an episode. Come on. Oh my gosh, this is just... Where am I going? Okay. <laughs> it helps to look up and make sure you're not going to just literally float off into no, Never Neverland or something, right? Just... It's pretty simple. There we go. Oh, come on. Oof, I'm struggling. I'm struggling so far. Um, but... But we got lucky with finding a boat that quick, so I really, really don't want to complain. Feeling good. In fact, where is that stinking boat? There it is. Let's 
get our boat on. Because once we have a boat, everything changes. I need a... I, I needn't worry about falling as much and, and all that stuff. Um, so, you just, this just turns into a different game as soon as you get your elytra. It's like a different video game, uh, which is really cool. I, I love that about Minecraft. Like, in fact, I would say that about like all the different like big progress steps in Minecraft. Um, it's like you're playing different games at different stages. Um, but at the same time, you don't have to progress and you don't, I don't know. Yeah, I, there's so many great things I could say about Minecraft. Um, but I'm not getting paid to do it, so I'm not going to waste my breath. <laughs> I don't know. Is that a bad attitude to have? Yeah, I don't mean it. Um, I, I could. I could say lots of good things about this video game. It brings me joy. It brings a lot of people joy, so I appreciate that. i um, probably going to get sniped by a shulker, which is fine, because then I can just kind of float over to the boat instead of having to use up all my blocks. But I won't be pillaring around so much anymore. <laughs> doop, 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 doop. Let's go get ourselves a dragon head while we're at it, huh? I'm gonna float away. Quick grab the ladder. Oof. Check that out. Like a pro. Ow. Of course I get hit again. Let me just snipe these fools real quick. Yes, I hit him. Crow's nest for the win. Ow. I got hit again. I am gonna float away to the abyss. That's actually pretty dangerous. Pro move right there. Pro move using the ender pearls to negate fall. Woot woot. Boom. Come on. Oh, I hate when they do that. We have an elytra. Sky is the limit. Ooh, diamonds and oh, that's a good pick. In fact, I wish I had an anvil. What am I doing with myself? Feather fall on four. Oh, we're getting loot. We're getting loot just like that. Boom. Insta loot. All right. My inventory's a mess. Um, the rest of this end hunting thing is going to be kind of more of the same over and over and over again. And if you really love watching it, I don't know what to tell you. I don't really care to film it all unless something really interesting happens. Or I find some really spectacular loot, although we just kind of did. Like, that's a good combo right there. Um, so, yeah, without all of that, I'm just going to cut and maybe even meet you back at the overworld. But I'll, but I'll probably cut in a couple times just to show you some good loots that we're getting um, and how many elytra we get and all that good stuff. But I'll, I'll, I'll show you all that at the end either way. So I'll see you in a minute. All right, so I'm cutting back in here for just a second because... I actually gathered enough iron in these little loot chests, <laughs> useless, um, so that I could make one of these, uh, one of these, because I found that really nice pick, right, the efficiency 5 and unbreaking 3, and it's actually going to just be, wait a minute, 8 versus, th okay, yeah, I know what I want, huh? Um, yeah, that's gonna be way better. Let me let me title this what we want. Silky smooth. <laughs> Silky smooth. Cool. All right, because that's pretty much the best silk touch you can get, except for uh, what? Oh, by the way, I have four elytra now. I'm wearing one, so I have four. In fact, since this is the durability is kind of suffering, let's just do this. So we don't accidentally fall out of the sky. So we have, we have four elytra. Um, things are going good. We're about to get a fourth dragon head because they're sweet. We've got some diamonds. Like seriously, seriously good loot. But I'm not even done yet. So I shouldn't even be showing you this. Because um, I, I got more in me. I'm ready to keep exploring. I haven't even been at it that long. This is just the greatest. Um, so yeah, 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 yeah. All right. See you when I am actually done. Let's get the heck out of here. Ooh, that was a little scary for some reason. <laughs> I could hear myself like kind of fall like pfft. it was a little freaky anyways uh yeah let's get out of here we got lots of good loot and we have um well I don't want to say it let's just get home safe and then I can brag um I got the end not the end what do you call it the the, the ender egg I think oh look it's the credits where yeah we're not gonna read that but you should read it if you are playing through minecraft or maybe you have played through and beat the dragon multiple times you've never read those credits you really should it's kind of hilarious and uh 
I don't know, kind of deep. At least it's pretending to be deep, a little tongue-in-cheek. Um, all right, here's our loots. We actually, hold on, let me just set this up the right way. Don't look. <laughs> okay, here's some of our loots. Not half bad. Here's some more. Okay, right. Um, most of these aren't like anything too, too crazy, although that's decent. We already had one of those, but I'm happy to have another. Da, 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 da. Um, definitely will make use of almost all of these. Got a little mending from my booties. Um, I'll try to figure out how to work that in. Plenty of dragon heads, etc., etc. So, the, I mean, the star of the show. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Elytra. Elytron. Um, <laughs> yeah. I'm really happy with that because I don't think I've ever done better. I don't think I've ever had more Elytra in one world because now that I have this many, I'm really not going to go out of my way to get more. I don't think I'll ever use them up. I'll, I'll just throw unbreaking and mending on like a few of them, a couple of them, and uh, have plenty for like ever. Um, so I'm going to sort through everything. I'm going to like make my ender chest more organized. I'm going to do a lot sort of off camera um, right now and kind of organize things the way I want them. I'm fairly disorganized right now with all of this loot and all this good stuff. I have 57 levels, so like I should figure out what to do with that stuff. Maybe get better armor. I, I don't know. Um, also, like a main concern of mine, uh, let me put these away before I die with them somehow right how many chests do i got as loots okay apparently not a lot um my main concern i really want to get this villager breeder up and running like for realsies uh, actually let me put one of these in my ender chest just in case bad things happen Can always do that uh anyway yeah i'll organize that when you're not watching because it's boring but i am really quite concerned that this is not working and i want it to work um, I really want it to work, so I'm going to figure that out. Um, but here's a positive. I can, I can now remove this horrible, disgusting pillar, um, because I can fly. I don't need a pillar up to things anymore. Ladders are a thing of the past. I mean, I could have made it a bubble column, but, but still, you know, whatever. Um, yeah, now that I can fly, things are just different. Things are different, and I have Silk Touch Efficiency 5, Unbreaking 3, which is another kind of game changer for me. I quite value that, I would say. Um, yeah, what else? What else? I don't know. We're going to get our hands on some goodies, like, in times to come. It's time to start farming lots of different cool stuff. Um, in case you've never, like, made it this far into the game, there's a lot more left. Just because we beat the end certainly does not mean this is the end. Oh, no. This is the beginning it's a total misnomer, trust me. <laughs> um, yeah, so anyways, we're going to have lots more fun, more to come. I'm going to get rid of that ugly thing. What I want to do before I wrap up the episode, I think this is a fairly short episode, but like, I don't know. I don't know. I'd, I'd, again, I'd rather go short than long. Okay, lots of, lots of lag still in this version. Uh, I want to fly around this area because we haven't been able to do that. We haven't done any really, even what I might consider basic exploring because... I don't know. You should probably wait until you can fly to do that. And now we can fly. So let's just do that real quick. Let me gather up all this junk right here. Um, okay. Yep, got it. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, and yes, I am so excited for what's to come. I'm going to fix my villager breeder, get some awesome enchants through that, hopefully sooner rather than later. Um, what else? What? Oh, yeah, we definitely need to start farming um, mm -hmm, creepers, mm -hmm, to get firework rockets. Oh, you know what I wanted to do? Did I show you this? I'm going to make a big old map back here eventually, because that's fun. Definitely, definitely going to do that. That's always a blast. Um, where are we? Let's fly around. Like, let's see what we haven't yet seen. We haven't seen anything. Uh, yeah. This is our base, bird's eye view. We kind of had a basic idea from, from building that even and looking around. But um, I'm going to end up filling in this entire map and eventually, hopefully, at least eight others. <laughs> so we can have a big sort of three by three huge chunk of a map on the back of my base. And that just looks so cool. 
trust me, it, it's going to look really cool. Ooh, I should gather up a bunch of ice for future projects. I didn't realize how ex expansive this all was. We can loot some of the nearby boats that we didn't know existed until now. Um, I didn't realize there was such a big foresty area right here as well. Like, there's, I mean, what did I say? Foresty? I meant, like, frosty. I don't know what word I was looking for. Like, snowy area. Lots of cool stuff to come. I really actually want to find a uh, nearby desert as soon as possible. Doesn't even have to be nearby because we can fly. It can be pretty far away. I don't care, man. Yeah. Anyways, I'm going to do lots of fun exploring. I might even fill in a couple of maps off camera just like, you know, get home from work and uh, want to play a little Minecraft but nothing terribly exciting to film. I will actually just fly around and just load in a bunch of maps. And uh, if I find anything cool, I'll show you. Like, even, like, rare biomes or whatever, I'll show you. Don't worry. But, yeah, that's going to be really, really neat. I'm going to find a cool little mining desert so I can gather a bunch of sand. Um, and other stuff. Lots of good stuff to come. Trust me, like I say. Uh, we're going to be getting into lots of farms um, in the very near future. But, like, guys, like, let's just appreciate the fact that it's episode 5 and I'm flying around. Dragon is dead. We'll, we'll respawn her as needed, but <laughs> this is just good, good stuff. I love the way this series is going. I'm pretty proud of it. Um, and yeah, I just actually, I mean, it's, we're still kind of beta testing this whole YouTube thing, right? Like, right, like, this is my technically fourth series on the channel, but I cut the vegan one short because of reasons. I don't even think I ever fully explained that. I will in a later video. Um, the first, the uh, so sorry, the uh, second one had like two episodes. Pathetic. Shouldn't even be counting that. Like literally, shouldn't even. Be. We're just getting started. Like I feel like I've barely showcased the fun that I like to have in a Minecraft world. So that being said, lots more to come. I'm really excited, and I'm really happy that uh, I'm getting back into the swing of things as far as filming Minecraft. Cause I love it. It's it's good. It's real good. Yeah, that's gonna look so cool when we have a big old, big old map, and it's just like, ba boom, the whole, the whole shebang right here, just like a big old map. I could even, well, no, this is that's too ambitious. I was gonna, I could fill in the whole thing. No, not in a sixteen by sixteen map, not at all. Nope, or whatever you call it, not sixteen. What am I saying? You know what I mean? One by sixteen. You see how it says they're scaling at? Um, yeah, no, but maybe smaller maps. I don't know. Maps are fun. I, maps are fun. Anyways, that's going to do it for episode 5. Uh, we have 7 elytra on hand. We have dragon heads. We have dragon eggs. We have a dead dragon. We have lots of cool stuff. Diamond gear, all sorts of fun things, and again, scratching the surface. So I hope you enjoyed, and I hope you will continue to enjoy as we continue to make fun episodes for you. It's been Surgeon. I hope you had fun. I'll see you later. Peace out.